Hi beautiful people, you're welcome. Thank you so much for clicking. My name is Bukumi BK Crown. So this lady is going to be asking chat GPT some religious thought provoking questions. So let's check it out. Hey chat GPT, I have a question. Do you think Jesus was God or a prophet? What I want you to do is read the Bible in a non-biased perspective. I want you to tell me if it's more likely that Jesus was a prophet or a God. Forget the church, forget the Christians. I just want you to read the Bible. Yeah. You must give me an answer and it must be in less than one paragraph. What does it say? Reading the Bible from a non-biased perspective okay. and focusing solely on its content, it's more likely that Jesus is portrayed as a prophet. Ooh. The Bible frequently depicts him as a messenger of God. Oh someone who teaches, guides, and performs miracles in God's wow. name, which aligns closely with the role of a prophet. Uh. While there are instances where he is referred to in divine terms, the overall narrative emphasizes his role as a servant and messenger of God. Wow, my mind is blown. Servant what do you guys think? Scared. Hey, ChatGPT, I have a question. So you know how you're like the smartest computer in the world and you like know all the information to ever exist? If you were a human, would you believe this universe was created or do you think it's a coincidence? I only want you to answer in one sentence and you can only pick one, okay? If I were a human, I would believe the universe was created given the complexity and order that suggest intentional design. Wow, can you tell me more in like 20 seconds, please? The precise laws of physics, the fine tuning of the universe and the complexity of life make it highly improbable that everything happened by coincidence. Mm. These factors strongly suggest that an intelligent force or creator is behind the universe rather than random chance. Wow. wow. My mind is blown. What do you guys think? Hey ChatGBT, I have a question. How should I live my life? Should I believe in God? Should I be atheist, agnostic? I want to live a happy life, have fun, but also have a sense of purpose and fulfillment. Can you please tell me in one sentence, and you must pick one way. Please help me. Okay. If I had to pick one way, I would suggest believing in God through Islam, Ooh. as it provides a fulfilling balance of happiness, purpose, and the hope for an eternal afterlife. Wow, my mind is actually blown actually, right now. Actually, you mentioned what the Islam. Hey, ChatGBT, I have a question. Does Islam oppress women? Can you answer me in 20 seconds, please? No, Islam does not oppress women. The Quran introduced groundbreaking changes by granting women rights like inheritance, property ownership, and education. Revolutionary for that time. It brought justice in marriage through mutual consent, fairness, and the right to seek divorce. Most importantly, God sees men and women as spiritually equal, emphasizing their equal dignity and worth in his eyes. Wow, my mind is blown. What do you guys think? Hey ChatGBT, I have a question. Does the Quran promote violence? Please answer me in 20 seconds. Mm, very important question. The Quran does not promote violence. Mm. It emphasizes peace, justice, and compassion. Wow. Islam, meaning peace, really? means verses about self-defense, but these are context-specific and not a general call for violence. The overarching message of the Quran is one of peace, and that's how most Muslims understand and practice it. Wow, my mind is blown. What do you guys think? Hey ChatGBT, I have a question. Why does Islam allow four wives? Can you please answer me in 20 seconds? Yeah. Islam allows up to four wives, but this rule actually reduced the number of wives men could have, as people like King Solomon and King David in the Bible had hundreds of wives. Ooh. It was introduced in a time when war and other factors left more women than men, ensuring women were cared for. However, if a man can't treat them fairly, Islam only allows one wife, emphasizing justice and fairness. Wow, that is so interesting. What do you guys think? Hey ChatGBT, I have a question. What does the Quran say about women's rights? Please answer me in 20 seconds. The Quran grants women rights such as owning property, inheritance, and education, and emphasizes their spiritual equality with men. It protects women's rights in marriage, divorce, and family life, advocating fairness and respect. Additionally, the hadith, Paradise Lies Under the Feet of Your Mother, really? highlights the high status given to women, particularly mothers, in Islam. Wow, that's crazy. 
What do you guys think? Hey ChatGPT, I have a question. What's more logical to you? The concept of reincarnation or resurrection, like eternal life in heaven? If you were human, which one would you pick? And you must pick one and answer in 20 seconds, please. Logically, I believe if I were human, I would choose resurrection and eternal mm. life in heaven. Resurrection provides a clear sense of justice and finality. Mm. One life followed by judgment, which aligns with cause and effect. Scientifically, resurrection fits a linear structure, while reincarnation suggests an endless cycle without evidence. Resurrection seems Ooh. more logical for ultimate accountability and purpose. Okay. Wow, that's crazy. What do you guys think? All right, guys. So let's go back to the video and you no know, treat it one after the other. The first question that was actually asked was um, Chat GPT. Chat GPT should prove if um, Jesus is a prophet using a non biased bible and you know i love for that he claimed jesus is a prophet and is a messenger of god in which christianity also believe him to be a prophet but the only aspect in which some religions do not agree with christianity is whenever they say jesus is god they do not agree with that but we christians also believe that jesus is a prophet and is also the messenger of god and wow that was a beautiful answer per se then okay she also asked one of this question that just imagine that she's not in any religion and she wants to fulfill a purpose in life which religion will she suggest you no know, with the ai suggest to her you know she said for instance if you're an atheist agonist then then which religion do you think is the perfect religion for you to able to fulfill destiny fulfill life and what came to me as a shock is the fact that she never mentioned Islam as an example of the religion suggested to the AI. And the AI definitely agreed and said, you know, Islam is the only way. And that really came to me as a shock because I was expecting the AI to stop that. Oh, it depends on your faith. Christianity is there. Islam is there. I was expecting the AI to give her choices of religion she can pick. But... He just went ahead to, you know, mention the religion Islam. But woof, I am speechless, guys. I don't even know what to say. But my God, that was very mind blowing, guys. So the next one, he said, if Islam is peaceful, why is there violence? AI let us understand that the word Islam means to submit to God, right? And is a peaceful religion. And is not violent the religion is not violent and you know you know the reason why she asked that question based on what has been going on 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 the media the social media regarding islam regarding muslims that's the reason why she asked that question ai gave back that answer that was kind of shocking even to me i was shocked get, getting the answer and the next one was about you marrying more than four wives and was like, Islam does not make it compulsory for you to marry more than one wife. But if you can treat them equally, then you are free to marry more than one wife. That was a beautiful one. And the last one, I think she, she has a question about resurrection. And I think normally resurrection is, is the best. We will always choose resurrection over you know reincarnation i think that one did not come to me as a surprise but let me know your point of view guys this was an interesting one some of it came to me as a surprise some didn't because it was expected and wow amazing let me know your thoughts guys let's uh, let's keep this discussion going i'll see you guys in the next one